When a group of fishermen heard whines coming from a nearby river bank, they went to investigate. However, as they got closer, they realized their help was urgently needed. As a result, they embarked on a brave rescue mission. In February 2016, some fishermen were out for a day on the river. Although the weather was extremely cold, they were enjoying a relaxed time, seemingly bobbing along without a care. But suddenly about the sound of water lapping against their boat, they heard a strange whining noise. The unusual sound piqued the fishermen's curiosity, and they were keen to discover its source. So they put down the rods and headed off down the river. As they did so, they followed the direction of the noise. As the men got closer to the origin of the whining, they noticed a small black shape on the river bank. One of them tried to whistle to the object, but his lips was too cold to get any sound out. So instead, he began calling it out, in a bit to find out it was alive. When their boat approached the river bank, the fishermen were shocked to realize that the object was actually an animal. From its outline, it was clear to see the creature was in fact a dog. The hound stood stranded by the shore with no obvious means of escape. Spotting its potential saviors on the horizon, the dog began to cry out louder. Then, as the boat approached, the pooch ran down the shoreline to meet them. I wondered how the hell did he get out there? One of the men wondered in a video posted on YouTube in 2016. When the men finally cut the boat's engine and glided closer to the bank, they realized that the dog was just a little puppy. The pooch appeared to have a friendly demeanor and ran up to greet them as they pulled up. However, the animal's amiable disposition must have belied the ordeal he had been through. Now that they could get a closer look, the fishermen discovered that the dog was thin and cold. He was also a little jittery, which posed a problem. Since the men couldn't get the boat any nearer to the shore, they needed the dog to take a leap of faith. Before they could transport the adorable animal to safety, they needed to cross several feet of water. However, though it was only a few inches deep, the dog seemed unwilling to do so. Instead, it stood on the riverbank, crying out for the men to come to him. As a result, all the fishermen could do was wait for things out. As the puppy sauntered up and down the river's side, they stopped filming for a while. By the time the cameras rolled again, the men had found a spot where they could get their boat nearer to the shore. Now all they had to do was clear some branches out of the way and they would be in touching distance of the little doggy. Eventually, their efforts paid off. Soon, one of the men could lean over the side of the boat and grab the pup by the scruff of the neck. He lifted the dog into the boat. Once there, the puppy began exploring his new environment, sniffing around as a fisherman cooed over his cuteness. After acquainting themselves with their new four-legged friend, the men whisked them back to dry land. Following the epic rescue, one of the fishermen posted two videos documenting their adventure online. Together, the videos have clocked up more than 2 million views online, and many of the people who have watched the footage have since congratulated the men on their selfless actions. This story made my day, read one of the many comments on the videos. Glad you guys took the time to rescue this little dog. He seemed like he was ready to go to. Hope he has a new forever home now. Later, the man who uploaded the videos, known only as his YouTube username, Spring River King, returned to the site with an update. Posted in March 2016, a few weeks after the rescue, the video revealed some positive news. The puppy is doing good, he explained. We found him a forever home. Really not long after we got the puppy. It was a day or so. He's got a new family, he added. He also took the opportunity to address some of the queries that had emerged following the video's rise to popularity. And it seemed the question on everybody's lips was this, why didn't he simply step into the river and retrieve the puppy from the bank? The bank there, it was mud, Spring River King revealed. We would have probably needed our own rescue if we had tried to step off the boat that day. It was really soft mud, but we knew the puppy could make it across pretty easy. In the end, no harm was done to the dog and they were able to deliver him safely. He was really thin, but I took him home that night, fed him, got him cleaned up, and somebody was wanting him the next day. So he got a good home. Spring River King added. So having gone from being completely alone on the edge of an icy river, the lucky pup found himself in a warm home surrounded by love. And not only has he got his new family to look out for him, he also has cores of online fans rooting for him too.